The woman taking the pictures is obviously smarter than you. She knows that I'm not going to take a picture with you because you're just as rednecked as every person in this building. Everybody wants to be a redneck around here, huh? Huh? Well, I'm tired of being humiliated, okay? I'm tired of wearing this freaking dress. I'm tired of everybody laughing at me. As a matter of fact, I'm tired of everybody in this building thinking that it's funny that my life is humiliation. I think that every one of you need to shut up just like Tommy Redneck. How about we say next week we cut the humiliation shut and forth and stop it in its tracks. How about next week the match I'm talking about if I win it. Well, actually, when I win my match, I take this ridiculous dress off. And the match I'm talking about, the match I'm talking about is not only me against everybody here. Because you're all definitely behind the man. I'm talking about John Michael against Tommy Redneck one-on-one. -on -one. Okay. Let me see. What's in it for me if I was to beat you next week? If you win... You get to take the dress off. Okay. I will win and I will take the dress off. Hey, hey, hold on. You've had egg all over your face all night tonight. So how about next week? If you beat me, you take the dress off. But, hold on, there's always a but. But when I beat you, me and every one of these great fans right here in Rector, Arkansas, get a chance. A chance to bust you right in your face with an egg. What do y'all say? Shut up, you bunch of rednecks. Let me tell you something right now, Tommy Redneck. It's not if I win, it's when I win, and I will do anything. And I repeat myself very clearly when I say I will do anything to not be embarrassed anymore. And I will do anything to get out of this ridiculous dress. So you know what? Next week, I will not be egged in the face by these stupid inbred rednecks here. And next week, I will take this dress off and I will not be humiliated anymore. And you know how I will do that? Right in front of all your stupid fans here, I will pin your shoulders to the mat. One, two, three. You came to see Slim the Bulldog Pickens, who doesn't have a snowball's chance in hell of beating the Golden Boy Greg Anthony. And after I beat him, I'm going to do to you just what we did to Chris O'Neill. You will never, never be seen in Rector, Arkansas again. I promise. And when the Golden Boy Greg Anthony makes a promise, it's as good as gold. Collar and elbow tie up here. Golden Boy pushes Slim Pickens back into the corner. And Slim blocked the right hand and nails one of his own. Series of right hands on the Golden Boy. Golden Boy is rocked here. Slim backs him up. Irish whip across the ring. And a high back body drop. Kick to the midsection. Slim with a right hand to the Golden Boy's head. Another right hand. Just teeing off on the Golden Boy here. And now cover one, two, only two. Golden Boy trying to beg off here and rake the eyes of Slim Pickens and tosses him to the floor. Slim trying to get back in the ring here and a shoulder block into the midsection, up and over to Sunset Flip. Will he get the Golden Boy over? Jeff Odell holding the Golden Boy's hands. Trina kicks the hands, Golden Boy over. One, two, only two. And a clothesline. Oh, what a chop from the Golden Boy. Oh, another chop. Irish whip, Slim Pickens sent into the corner. Golden Boy measures him, nobody home. Right hand from Golden Boy, right hand from Slim, right hand from Golden Boy, right hand from Slim. They're trading shots here in the center of the ring. And Slim Pickens getting the better of it. Rocking the Golden Boy here, backs Golden Boy up. Irish whip, reverse, Slim off the ropes. Oh, DDT from Slim Pickens. Irish whip. Golden Boy up on the second turnbuckle. Slim puts on the brakes. Catches the Golden Boy here. What's this going to be? 
Oh my goodness. What a modified bulldog. Cover. One, two, three. But the Golden Boys foot was on the ropes. And Serena Fowler counted three. Here's your winner and new LAW heavyweight champion, Slim the Bulldog Pickens. Serena, look. The Golden Boys foot is on the bottom rope. It's been there for the last two minutes. You got a three, and his foot was on the ropes. Are you telling me you didn't see it? It doesn't matter if you saw it, because I saw it. And if you don't restart the match right now, I'm going to fire you. Give me that. Restart the match. Serena Fowler's restarting this match. She doesn't want to lose her job, and Slim Pickens is obviously discouraged. The Golden Boy with a double leg takedown and a cover one, two, and the Golden Boy's foot is on the ropes. The Golden Boy steals this one and retains the title. Slim Pickens arguing with the Golden Boy, and Jeff O'Dell nails him from behind with the belt. I said after I win this match, I was going to take this punk kid out. Are they going to spike pile drive him here? That's our call for what? You can't just afford it. Look out, Golden Boy. That's not Jeff Odell behind you. That's Tommy Redneck in the asylum. Look out. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, you got a problem now, Golden Boy. Golden Boy trying to sneak Sick by here. Him. Sick him. Rob Thompson giving the order to sick him. Sick him. Golden Boy's trapped in no man's land here. Oh my goodness. And they're taking turns with the right hands on the Golden Boy. The Golden Boy, the victim of a three-on-one assault from Tommy Redneck in the asylum. My goodness. And folks, he deserved this. Tommy Redneck sends him out to the floor. Now Tommy Redneck helping up Slim Pickens. Oh, look at this. The crowd is loving this. That's the man who should have won.